We're part of Poet Nation. It's a Somali art and culture hub that engages youth from around the world in poetry, music, spoken word, storytelling. And my name is Matt Erickson. My name is Abdi Phenomenal, and I'm a spoken word artist from Minneapolis, Minnesota, uh, from Poet Nation. I'm in Poet Nation, as he said, is a, a website, a group, a media group that uh, promotes art and culture and peace through poetry. I was expecting to see everything that I've seen on TV. And to see that um, they were humans. They were, they were people like my next door neighbor. They, were, they have value. Those people have value. Instead of seeing what I used to see or what I was seeing, uh, on the news, I saw far more graphic things than that. Um, I felt really, really sad. I felt angry. Um, I felt a lot of grief. I felt hopeless, powerless. Um, I didn't know what to do. There was a time where actually seeing all this would bring me back small, small memories. Um, and there was times where I actually, I couldn't take it no more. And I take like a five minute break. I was just in the corner. I had to regroup my thoughts. I felt a bit angry. My sense of justice was rising up inside of me. As we're living in 2011, there's no reason that we should have a famine in 2011. We had a, we had a famine 20 years ago and the world rallied around the Horn of Africa. You know, here- Second time, no. In 2011, here we have another famine but I really feel this is a <clears throat> sort of a man-made famine. Oh, Martin Luther King said, Just, injustice anywhere is a threat to justice everywhere. And so there are some injustices going on in the Horn of Africa. And the world needs to take notice of that. And I feel that this famine, of course, there are circumstances in, in such as weather and rain and that, those sorts of things outside our control. But there are human factors as well. I would expect them to help create a long-term solution because yeah, it's, it's great that I'm eating today, but how do I know I'm gonna eat next week or next month or next year? You know, there needs to be just as much effort put into a long-term solution.